Hey guys, this is Garis and welcome to another episode of Survival Overdone and thank you for joining my game video channel. We are once again in Gaia and we are at the loading screen for a very specific reason. There was yet another update, a big update and yes, unfortunately we had to start over again but not to worry guys. Um, the developer told me we'll implement a way that we can start off easier so I don't have to rebuild everything again so we're just waiting for that patch again but look in the bottom left corner guys we have a lot more stats we track now so um, this is all the um, stats we track or that we can track now I believe a blue one is thirst and hygiene then it's hunger and bladder and then it's health I'm not sure this only game just came in and then I believe it is Wait, 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 I have something wrong now. Oxygen and water. I think those two go together. And then it is leisure and sanity. No, leisure and hygiene by any chance? Or sanity. Oh well, either way, we got a few new updates. Um, unfortunately, the last update, also again, there was a problem with a uh, update and then the developer brought out a hot fix and it made all the large rock formations disappear so we will go with what we can at this stage and once a, a developer implemented the part where you can start off with a okay it's basically cheaty in a way that we summon all the things that we have built I will do that on cam so that I can show you guys I'm not overly cheaty so I'll just grab the things that we left off the previous episode basically so that we are, can start a game where we left off so to speak so unfortunately I am not yet where we were on a previous episode so we got a turret assembler and so on up and running but we needed some things for that still so but I will continue with that and I will bring you guys back so I just thought of bringing you in quickly for the um, state of affairs so we'll see you in a bit oh also I just got here to make um, ourselves another generator we got textures for the ores I suggested that to a developer that we getting confused with all the ores and this is what he did so this is just a temporary texture just to make it easier for us to remember what ore is what which ore is which Something along those lines. Oh, and a massive update, guys, is the uh, building. So, things, even if it just touches a little, you can build it. Um, it doesn't require you to get a whole um, ceiling or a floor away. So, that means ooh, we need water. That's not what it means. But now we can build pillars and walls. So, pillars you need to basically build on each intersection and then with walls in between but we'll get to that um, but later first we need to focus on this getting our base where it was we need a furniture assembler and the turret assembler oh and the ammo things okay you guys sat with this before so I'm not gonna waste your time now with the thing again okay, so just thought I'll bring you in with an update with all the ores this is awesome, so this is actually good, so we can see what which is chrysophrase and which is copper, which is bloodstone. So this is awesome. And what else? I think that's... Oh, uh, just for small curious, curiosity sake, you also change some settings. You can change now daylight and night time. So because previously the night was pitch black and different graphic cards... Um, translated it differently that's a correct word to use so he brought it in so it's manual sliders I haven't played too much with it yet so I'm not sure which one makes it darker or lighter but I feel this is a bit too bright the previous night wasn't this so I quit and I loaded the save and it was a bit brighter so but in any case enough babbling we'll see you in a bit after we got everything up and running as we were Okay, I thought I'll quickly bring you guys in for a quick update. 
we have our furniture assembler, we have our bed, uh, we still still just need our turret, um, turret assembler. So, but for that we need research. So I'm busy researching there on the the path there. So it's spot and then it's turret. So we're almost there. But I wanted to show you guys what I mean, meant a bit earlier about the building. In a previous version or a previous release, you couldn't build this close. So this also means I'll be able to fit in another generator over here. If you look closely, you can, it will just fit each other closely if I put another generator here. And previously that wouldn't have been the case. So awesome for that. And something that I have now more than I had previously is more cupboards. But I want to show you guys this. Now it, more cupboards fit in one um, panel, floor panel. So this is awesome. So we can now have multiple drawers or cabinets. Oh, and something major that we missed the previous time. If you click here and you put in a copper, let's put in copper. Um, I saw if you put a nice bottom row the furthest away from left, you can click all of them and all of the same ones will fit in. But look now, if you look at the bottom drawer, there is another space and I didn't know that. So this is quite cool, but I'm not going to put copper in there. I'm going to put, oh, crystal phrase. I'm going to put crystal phrase in here because copper is going to be in the bottom one. You get dizzy when you get thirsty. So, okay, and also, you see that in the distance, guys? Let me go into first person view. We have crops. Okay, so what you do, I think I did mention this in the previous, you go here, you left click, and then you can interact with the panels. So this is awesome. So let's see if we can harvest any of these. Letters. Okay, this is my first time with letters. So let's see how many that falls. Only three hunger. Well, at least it's, it's a few hunger that we didn't have. Oh, we must get that aubergines and research aubergines, we must plant aubergines, eggplants that is. We figured that out in a previous episode as well, so if any one of you guys are joining us now for the first time. Aubergines, I don't know if I'm pronouncing that correctly at all. Um, uh, my native language is not English unfortunately, so I may pronounce that completely wrong. So let's eat all of them. Okay, let me quickly show you the aubergines, then you can see what I mean. It's just over our eyes here. Ah, maybe not enough time. Oh, there's one right there. Oh, an awesome si another addition. You have now a mouth. Mu uh, can't speak today. A knife. Now you have a melee action. Oh, awesome. So now you can kill chickens and save on bullets. Come on. Okay, you must just run around after the chicken catching it and slicing and dicing and stabbing and... Yeah. yeah. So if you run out of bullets and don't want to waste bullets on food and you're running out of food, this is an option as well. And the knife's name is Butterfly. I was told. So, interesting name, I wonder why. <laughs> Can't see how a butterfly looks. Let's quickly go into first person and pull out a knife. Okay, so you only see that action, no problem. Oh, we need a bathroom. Excuse me for a bit while we do our bladder business. Let's see what's 100% now. Yes, it's green. So it's definitely green is a bladder. Oh, see, this is aubergines. Ah, oh, wrong button, sorry. So, eggplants, aubergines. Aubergines egg or eggplants are said to have originated on Gaia and have since spread to the entire galaxy. It is rumored that the plant can be used to create glow shade. No idea what glow shade is, but yeah, I'll we'll probably find out one of these days. There's rabbit rabbits. Rabies, rabbit rabbits, if you guys, if I pronounce that also incorrectly, but any case, I, annoying rabbits, yeah, from now on it's annoying rabbits. 
and yes so fortunately we haven't been attacked yet again I've been attacked right before the I started the episode so I, I'm expecting an attack anytime now soon a part is done so we can do so I'm at 3800 so I think we really need to start getting um, our defenses up and running and we need more generators let's see how much we need from generator everything chrysophrase and copper okay so I'm gonna mine more and get some two more generators up and running one year one year right uh, maybe I must make another floor then we can put the third one there and maybe put some more batteries because if once we go to turret each one pulls energy and look we're already at the brink of energy so yes so you also get um, solar panels and wind power but everything during the day affects that where wind speed and sunlight so depending on these two that depends on how much energy you get I believe they do give more energy but um, oh and you can also build them on the ground you don't have to build them on your base so that is also a nice thing but yes research unfortunately with the update previous update my all my research was was um, reset so I have to research everything so that's why we couldn't do the turret now or the turret assembler so I'm gonna put a turret assembler maybe here or maybe smack in the middle I saw that you can put a bed here and you can walk around it no problem nope. except if you walk into the bed and there's a wave okay so I'll take care of that and then I will see you back in a minute okay guys we left off just before the attack so I thought what better way of bringing you in just before a wave it does again so something happened <laughs> everything you see here is not what you saw a few moments ago um, the attack that we got in a, in a few seconds ago for you guys it crashed it made a bug so I quickly informed the developer and he um, quickly made a patch for that and updated like oh, half an hour so he's quite fast with his updates and it was fixed there was one or two small major glitches as well and also the rocks that was gone is fixed so and and get this but this mode is in <laughs> so everything is now awesome so that is why everything is new I cheated it in I know I said in a previous part that I'll have you guys but I don't want to have you guys in for that for now again so I basically got what we had um, few moments ago I replanted the crops again so we have crops also now so that's awesome I'm just waiting for the wave to attack oh oh yeah that is just um, if Amanda moves in a certain way this area appears but Dev knows about that it's a minor visual glitch I think it's to do with the feet if I'm not mistaken so nothing to worry about there furniture so I'm still busy with those ones with those research so where's the ground attack there it is okay so we seriously need to get the turret up and running because I'm not gonna struggle much more with this so also what I was thinking we can do for the rest of the um, episode is build the walls quickly I got a fifth generator and our three chests or cabinets with uh, some resources in there so we're good on that front and we need ammo so we need bloodstone quickly Okay, before we do that let's quickly see what we need for the ammo assembler or not the ammo assembler the turret assembler just want to grow this quickly and then 
uh, not grow, farm this quickly and then we can quickly plant again. So this one that has weird leaves seems like to be having oops, strong button to be having uh, more more to harvest than a normal one. So do I plant again? Oh uh, well, let's see what happens. Okay, so quickly check decoder is still busy with parts. Oh, we need the turret assembler still. Okay, so I'm quickly gonna go grab some ores and then we will make some balls while we wait for the research so that we can get our turret assembler. We'll see you in a bit. Okay guys, we are back. I was there by the sketchy place to farm. <laughs> but um, the sketchy meaning there's a lot of monsters on the way. And I thought I'll bring you in I'm on my way back. Just wanted to show that the developer brought in a swimming mechanic. And also, okay, I can't open my PDA in the water, but it's quite nice mechanic. Um, movement and such, so I just want to show you this. There we go, okay. Um, there's uh, oxygen here as well. I'm not sure which bar represents oxygen, but... Um, or maybe it's not yet fully implemented. But either way, we, the game is coming along nicely. Um, I'm not sure, I was thinking about now while I was mining over there, that the ores is always on at the same place. Well, this, I'm not sure if, I, this is what I'm not, was not sure if I mentioned before, is that this is a test map, so it, all variables is the same for the testing purposes. So this is also why this is a test play, uh, playthrough basically, but not a let's play. So we're testing all features and so on, and um, yes, yeah, so once procedural maps comes in, the ores and such won't be always at the same place. So you'll have to do exploring to find these type of things. In any case, um, also why I brought you in is because we have a wa wave waiting for us at our base. <laughs> so bullets, 183, and I'm sure it's going to be two creatures. And what type of creatures is it? Uh, oh, a beetle again, or two beetles then in that case. Or what? What's it? Uh, okay. We go. That's what I'm looking for. Uh, I was just out of reach the whole time. That's great. See, I hate it that it's two and then they get stuck in each other. So you think you're not shooting with one, and meantime you are shooting it, it's just a secondary one. So, but we have this one, right? I hope that's not a second one. Did we click the first one? Or click it? I can't remember. But it's becoming dark. Oh, and the sunsets in this game is pretty, guys. It's really pretty. Let's go into first person. This will make it much more prettier. I have one on a capture and it's very nice. Okay, so I think our turret is next. Okay, um, so that was port, so we need a port builder, right? Port assembler. Malicious assembler, I think. Miscellaneous. Not malicious, sorry, my bad. Robot. This is awesome. Um, this basically gives you small robots that assist you. There's three types you can choose from. One is a mining assistant, one is a damage assistant, and one is basically just storage. Or is that a mining assistant? Well, we'll figure that out uh, when we get to that. So that's part of the fun of a game, figuring it out. And especially no one else out there makes a video. So it's awesome that I can't go research it because at the moment my videos is the furthest long. So that's awesome. I like figuring out the stuff. So okay, oops, not escape. So that is chrysophrase, that is bloodstone, we have a few bloodstone. So this will be gold. 
I have some spare water in there. I must make another cabinet actually, and then some diamonds. Because we're gonna need bars. Let's quickly see what my wealth is at. Six thousand. Ouch. Because this one's the wealth is forty. Wow. Which one did I see? That's twenty. I think that's a bloodstone. Sixty. Oh my gosh, so that means in this game you can't hoard stuff. <gasps> um, yeah, wrong button. Chrysophrase, I think, is also... What did that play? 50. What was the... Maybe it was a poison bloodstone up. Just maybe getting messed about. <coughs> or confused about, sorry. Portals go away. Um, yes, let's do walls quickly. Let me show you how that works. Okay, so we need copper for walls. <coughs> okay, five. Okay, so at least you get four of each. Okay, so we need walls. Okay, so I think we only have one wall. Yes, okay, so let's craft two of them. And then pillars. Let's craft all of them. Okay, so what you should do is you go to your pillars. And as I said earlier, you have to put them on each intersection of of um, the floors. Oh, that's where that wind one went. How many do I have left? Probably not a lot. Let's go in here and then we go do the other side quickly. I wonder if there's doors. I'm honest, I have not seen doors. Oh no, so this one is making a problem. Okay, our problem at this stage, we will just build it out. We'll make a small entry. Let's see if this one can make it. Yes. This one and. What I'm actually wondered, worried about is the walls. Just want to make sure it's all is left. Walls. Okay, great. So that means, yes, we don't have a problem with, um, uh, what do you call it? Well, the uh, other structures being in a way that is. I'm gonna, I think maybe I must make this my new door. We'll see. Oh, come on. Oh, that's not nice. Because <laughs> having a door on this side, rather, then I can expand these a uh, walkway around here, basically, and I can put more cabinets, maybe, in that hallway. Hallway. So, basically, the um, floors here walls around and the problem is with the farm um, I need to go out another one for him as well so not to to um, compact but it's not an issue the first person again it's so you have to plant after each harvest good to know okay how far are you Go there, turret is still away. Okay, let's grab some more copper. Wow, that made two. Why did it do two? I need more walls. Walls, no, walls. Stairs, how much is stairs? Oh, it's bars. So we can actually make it upstairs. That would be awesome. And more pillars. Okay, great. Pillars, pillars. Okay. Uh, so some building times. Building a base. Forcing it a bit, so that's always nice. So would we have a bit of a proper base. 
So no, we want building menu and we want two walls. So we want a wall there and a wall there. Okay, and another wall. Come on, we can do it. There you go. And this side, why don't you snap this side? Come on. There you go. All else fails. Oh, and we need a wall here. See, we can't place a wall here because there's no pillar support on the other side of the wall. So, okay. Um, we'll figure out the rest a bit later. Because I'm not sure what you're going to do. The main assembler is in our way. How much does it cost to make a main assembler? Oh, we can't make another one. Oh, maybe that's part of the parts research. Uh, the parts too, maybe. Unlocks a microcontroller at the component assembler. So we need the component assembler as well. Component. Component assembler. Two copper and two gold. We can do that. So we have a storage now, so this is awesome. Two copper and then we did good component oh this is gonna take more power isn't it okay so another assembler how big is it you it's just not too big oh where are we splitting it's pretty dear then we can walk around Let's see how many power do we have? Oops. Oh no! How do I have two? No, 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 no. What was that? Does that make two? Oh well. Um, I hope our power will handle it. Let's see our power. Oh, it won't. Uh, what's the crafting cost? I make so many and I still can't figure it out. Eight and two. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And two crystal One, two. One, two. One, two. And we have an empty bottle again. Why do I keep picking up empty bottles? I threw them away inside the base earlier and I think that's where it's coming from. Yes, it's because it's not those, I need water in any case. And we need some food. Let's make another Jenny. Oh, we need one copper. Oh, genies, oh, genies, oh, genies. Okay. Let's see quickly how many. Yep, we are way over. Circuits, gold, bloodstone, and data disk. Okay, so we have those materials at least. So let's put a power generator down right here. I want to put another generator in this corner. And then we should have enough for everything, but I think I'm going to destroy this one. I'm going to waste half of my resources, but uh, why not? <coughs> um, okay, let's quickly make some floors, because I think that's important. Six, oh, we need copper. One copper will do, thank you. At least the... Uh, the structures for the um, buildings is cheap. Everything else seems to be so expensive. <laughs> and that at least of everything is not so much. The other three, let's do this and this. Okay, so we can build a wall here as well. Do we have more? We have four more. 
So why can we put this side on this side? But now we can. Oh well, that saves us some resources at least. And that is my last one. Let's see if we have more walls. We have three walls. Great. So we don't have to move our door. Unfortunately, we won't see the waves attack through the door, but if we have a turret somewhere out here, of course, it will always pass fine to get inside the base. We put a turret here. I wonder if it must be on a floor or not. Okay, let's see uh, how far our research is done. Awesome. Turrets. Turret ammo. Okay, quickly check what's the turret. Turret is in there. Turret is in there. Two blood, two gold, two diamond. Okay, so it's four of each basically then. So it's one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Crystal phrase. One, two. And again with the bottle. What the hell? Four. Bloodstone, where's bloodstone? Bloodstone is a bottle drop. One, one, two, three, four. Okay, so all of these must be smelted into bars. Two bars. Two. Come on. Two bars. Be careful when you click this guys because sometimes you don't switch and then you make more of the previous one. So just make a note of that. So turret assembler. Craft one. Great stuff. Let's see how much power we have actually after destroying that one component. Hey, we are good. We are good. We are good. If you guys didn't see we are producing 1200. We're only using 930. I think we're gonna need more batteries soon. I think the turrets use batteries. Yo, this is big. Yep, it's gonna be smack in the middle. Okay, let's see quickly. Tip. Turrets, okay, I think we did cover this in a previous one. Red ones. I'm just gonna take a screenshot of this for future reference. So if I forget the game. Oh, so this thing is big. Okay, we need more walls and goodies. Okay, so we can't go through there, but we can go through here and here. So we can move around our base at least. It's a bit difficult, but at least we can do it. I think we should make space here that we can go to the second floor. I've never built up that eye. This is the furthest I've built in the, this game. So turret, minigun turret. Oh no, microcontroller, data disk. Okay, diamond bar and crystal phrase is not a problem. Microcontroller and a data disk, okay. Both those items we get here. No, where's a microcontroller? Okay, so let's make a, what we can do. Okay, so we have a data disk. One copper, one crystal phrase. Copper, one crystal phrase. Okay, you can just move away to close the inventory, guys. Just for reference. Craft, okay, so you need microcontroller. Where are we getting that? A diamond bar and a crystal phrase bar. So let's put this here. A diamond bar is two and a crystal phrase bar is two. At least we can come this way. Crystal face bar. Diamond bar. I don't know if you saw that, guys. I had to click twice there to let it open. Okay, so we have three items we need. Uh, no, wait, they did say it unlocks a microcontroller, right? That's what we need. Just want to make sure. Microcontroller, yes. Okay, so that is our next research. Um, Let's research that. Okay, so I'm not sure how we are doing on time, guys. I think we're at the end of a episode. 
uh, running out of time so I'm gonna let that research finish um, also just a tip don't sleep every night only sleep the nights you want to go out the nights you're busy in your base like I am at this moment don't sleep because more days you go by the bigger the aliens will be that attack you eventually I think after 30 days in-game days the massive ship attacks you so what I'll do off game guys I'll get the ma uh, other materials the microcontroller and so on ready and I uh, will get all the materials to craft the minigun turret I'll do that on cam I won't let you guys miss that and but I'll finish the walls at, at least and I'll do that off cam well guys that will be the end of this episode I just want to ask again please leave a like if you like the video at any point in point in time and also dislike if you disliked it and please leave a comment why um, and give me feedback if you disliked it because I would like to know and uh, make my videos better and for your viewing pleasure I like recording the videos and I like if you guys liked it so yes please let me know and also you can follow me on Twitter at GodisG and also there's a website now live my it's an official website for my survival overdone series and uh, all of my series is survival overdone but it's uh, survival-overdone.com so please feel free to visit that all information is there question or uh, frequently asked questions i'll give answers there and all other links to my public discord I also have a public um, ARC server running at the moment. I set it up. Um, it's at the time of this recording, it's not set up yet. It's busy um, testing. and But I think by the time this episode is live, the ARC server will be live. So also come join me there. I will, you're more than welcome to join me on a public server. I will play there from time to time. I'm not. Um, not all of my time is spent there, so I'm not always active there, but you can feel free to come and get me there. So, And we can play together, we can go on adventures in ARC, um, and the current map there is the center, so feel free to come there. Also, I'll have a wave to take care of, so we'll see you in the next one. Cheers!